क्वेश्चन इज गिवन वन अपॉन फोर पावर एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स सो वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स हियर हाउ वी कैन फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स लेट सी सोल्यूशन वन अपॉन फोर पावर एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स दिस इज क्वेश्चन सो वी कैन राइट दिस वन अपॉन एक्स पावर फोर अपॉन एक्स वन अपॉन एक्स पावर फोर पावर एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स यूजिंग फॉर्मूला ए अपॉन बी पावर एम इज इक्वल टू ए पावर एम डिवाइडेड बाई बी पावर एम नाउ वी कैन मल्टीप्लाई बहुत साइड बाय फोर पावर एक्स बिकॉज वी हैव टू रिमूव दिस टर्म सो मल्टीप्लाई both sides by 4 power x then we will get 1 upon x divided by 4 upon x times 4 upon x is equal to x times 4 upon x right now 4 upon x 4 upon x so it will cancel we can write this 1 upon x is equal to x times 4 power x so 1 upon x value of 1 upon x is equal to 1 so we can write this x times 4 power x x times 4 power x is equal to 1 this is equation number 1 now uh, according to lambert w function a e power a is equal to we can write a this is the uh, lambert w function so if we are applying natural log here natural log property then we will get e power ln of a is equal to a right and e power ln of 4 is equal to 4 so this is equation number 2 so we are substituting equation 2 in equation 1 Value of four. Four is e power ln of four. So we will get here x times e power ln of four power x is equal to one. Right? Now x times e power x ln of four. We can write e power x ln of four is equal to one. Now multiply both side by ln of four. So if we are multiplying, multiply both sides by ln of four, then we will get, then we will get ln of four times x times e power x ln of four is equal to ln of four. We are multiplying both side by ln of four. now we will get here x times ln of 4 times x times ln of 4 times e power x ln of 4 is equal to ln of 4 now x ln of 4 times e power x ln of 4 is equal to this is ln of 4 so this ln of 4 we can write ln of 2 square 2 square that is 4 so ln of 2 square now x ln of 4 times e power x ln of 4 x ln of 4 is equal to now we can write this ln of 2 square that is 2 ln of 2 2 ln of 2 here 2 ln of 2 now x ln of 4 Times e power x ln of four is equal to now this two, this two we can write this two, this two we can write e ln of two is equal to two. So in place of two we can write e ln of two. So ln of two this one ln of two times e power ln of two this one e power ln of two. Now applying the Lambert W function.
W of x ln 4 times e power x ln 4 x ln 4 is equal to W of ln of 2 times e power ln of 2. Right? Now, you can see x ln of 4, x ln of 4. So, we can write here x ln of 4 according to Lambert W function. So, we will get here x ln of 4 is equal to here ln of 2 times e power ln of 2. So, we will get here according to Lambert W function ln of 2. So, ln of 2. Now, we have to find out the value of x. So, we have to remove this uh, ln. So, we can divide both sides by ln of 4. Divide both sides by ln of 4. Then we will get x ln of 4, x ln of 4 divided by ln of 4 is equal to ln of 2 divided by ln of 4 because we divide both sides by ln of 4. So, ln of 4, ln of 4, it will cancel here. So, left term that is x is equal to ln of 2 divided by ln of 4. So, ln of 2 divided by ln of 4. Now, x is equal to, we can write this ln of 2 divided by ln of 4. So, ln of 4, we can write in terms of power 2, ln of 2 square. 2 square is 4, so ln of 2 square. Now, is equal to, x is equal to, we can write this ln of 2 divided by, we can write this ln of 2 square is 2 ln, 2 ln 2 because power come this side. So, 2 ln of 2. Now, x is equal to ln of 2 divided by 2 ln of 2. So, this ln of 2 is divided by this ln of 2. So, we got value of x is equal to left, left term that is 1 upon 2. So, 1 upon 2 value of x is equal to 1 upon 2 and this is the correct solution. So, we can say 1 upon 4 power x is equal to 1 upon 2. Here value of x is equal to value of x is equal to 1 upon 2. Now, this is first method. Now, we are uh, solving this equation using second method. Second method is First question 1 upon 4 power x is equal to x, right? So we can write this 1 upon x power 4 upon x, sorry, 1 upon 4 divided by 4 power x is equal to x using same method that is a upon b power m is equal to a power m divided by b power m. So we can multiply both sides by 4 power x because we have to remove this term. So, multiply. We are multiplying here by 4 power x. Multiply both sides by 4 power x. Then we will get 1 upon x divided by 4 power x times 4 power x is equal to x times 4 power x. Now, 4 power x, 4 power x, it will cancel. So, 1 upon x is equal to x times 4 power x. Now, 1 upon x times 4 power x. So, we can divide both sides by x. Divide both sides by x. Because we have to remove this x. So, 1 upon x divided by x is equal to x times 4 power x divided by x. Now, this x is cancelled from this x. So, we can write here 1 upon x. 1 upon 1 power x that is 1 and here x. So, 1 upon x is equal to 4 power x. Now, we, we can do here one thing. We can take power 1 upon x. So, taking power both sides, 1 upon x. Taking 1 upon x, power both sides. We will get 1 upon x, power 1 upon x is equal to 4 power x, power 1 upon x. We are taking common, means we are taking power here, 1 upon x. Right? 
so we can write this 1 upon x power 1 upon x is equal to now 4 power x power 1 upon x so this power is cancelled from here x is cancelled from x so we will get here 4 right now 1 upon x power 1 upon x is equal to this is 4 so we can write this 2 square that is 4 right now you can see comparing in lhs and rhs power and base here base is 1 upon x power is 1 upon x means base and power is same same thing here base is 2 and power is 2 so if we are comparing base and power from lhs and rhs so you can say comparing base and power we will get 1 upon x is equal to 2 or 1 upon x is equal to 2 so 1 upon x is equal to 2 so we can say value of x is equal to x is equal to 1 upon 2 we got the same value by using both method x is equal to 1 upon 2 let's verify is this correct or not so let's verify so question is 1 upon 4 power x is equal to x if x is equal to 1 upon 2 then we have to verify this value so 1 upon 4 power x x is 1 upon 2 so 1 upon 2 is equal to 1 upon 2 we have to verify this 1 upon 2 now we can write this 1 upon 4 power 1 upon 2 so if we are separating term then we will get 1 power 1 upon 2 and 4 power 1 upon 2. 4 power 1 upon 2 right is equal to sorry question mark 1 upon 2 now 1 power 1 upon 2 that is we can write this here 1 upon this is 4 4 is 2 so we can write this 2 power 2 2 power 2 that is 4 power 1 upon 2 power 1 upon 2 question mark 1 upon 2 now 2 power 2 and here 1 upon 2 so here this will cancel so we can write power is cancelled here so we can write 1 upon 2 right so 1 upon 2 is equal to 1 upon 2 so we can say lhs is equal to rhs so value of x is equal to 1 upon 2 this is correct solution thank you